Jason Gillespie with the City of Greenville. I'm an engineer in the environmental group, and I'm a co-chair here on this monitoring committee. And I'm James Riddle. I'm a project manager with Wolpert. Uh, been really involved in this process on behalf of the county, and I'm also a co-chair of the monitoring committee. Our role as a committee is really to uh, was to figure out all of the existing sources of data that might be available that would help build a better model, but also to um, to fill any gaps. And when the modeling committee identified some areas of need, we were tasked with pricing that information and getting into the specifics um, of, of, of how much data and where it needed to be collected in order to help them uh, make that model better. The committee started collecting data sometime around the first of the year, so January, February of this, this past year. But the, the group as a whole has data that goes back, of course, many, many years that's being brought into the model. A lot of that infrastructure was already in place. There's, there's um, stream gauge stations along the river, and there's buoys uh, in, in uh, Boyd Mill Pond. So that's ongoing. But to supplement that, uh, there were things that were uh, grab samples that were collected um, along the river, below the treatment plants, uh, in the lake. Um, there's, there's some more uh, kind of uh, detailed analysis that was focused on uh, certain parameters in the lakes themselves, in Conistee and Boyd Mill Pond, so it really kind of varies depending upon the type of data that was needed. We have a scope of work that was specific to those gaps that the modelers needed, um, but there is other work that's ongoing, like particularly the stream gauge stations that's been funded for years, that will be funded uh, at least in the near future, and I think the intent there is to, you know, we, to this point we've been focused on building a, a current model, but I think down the road we'll be looking at the, the progress and hopefully uh, looking at potential improvements that have been made um, as a result of some of the BMPs that are put into place. The data that comes out is only as good as the data that goes in, and so most of this monitoring effort was targeted at improving the data coming in to get the desired outcomes and to get more specific outcomes and that with the collaboration with EPA on what to put in, what to go look for, what, what parameters we, wouldn't be good uh, so we didn't waste our time and then what parameters we needed to get that they needed and that's some of the seasonal data that we've been working on. And I think our role is important because we're almost, uh, we're, we're the accountability arm of this thing down the road, right? We, kind of the report card if you will, I mean we're assessing the, the improvements, so it's an integral part of making sure that the plans that were put into place are actually working, or if we need to refine those, you know, as we move forward.